everybody. Uh, greetings from Las Vegas. So we are here at the Mirage for a couple of days and then another day. I know it's a little confusing, but we have like a week long sort of Vegas trip. So um, I thought I would give you a quick look around at our room here at the Mirage. We've never stayed at the Mirage before, so I'm excited and we're lucky that we even got checked in because they had a whole huge problem with check-in. But luckily, we got to finally check in and got a room. So this is the room. So here's the front door for the room and right next to it is a closet, which I have yet to look in. Oh, very nice hangers. So I'll probably need more hangers. And an iron and an ironing board and a luggage rack and a safe. Okay. Oh, I think that light came on automatically. Hmm, let's see. I don't know, I can't tell if the light turns off. Okay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and here's the bathroom. Looks pretty nice. Oh, that lighter on that mirror is um, really bright. We got some glasses and Kleenex. And little soaps. And shampoo and body lotion and conditioner. Sorry, I'm filming with my iPhone, so if my aim is worse than usual, that's why. It's because I'm not used to holding my iPhone. Um, yeah, you can, the light goes all the way around the mirror. That's crazy. That is super duper bright. And they have a makeup mirror. That's kind of cool. I mean, they don't use anything that magnified, but it's nice that they have it. Um, do they have a hair dryer? They do. Nice. Let's see if there's anything over here. No. And towels. Okay, looks like plenty of towels. And the bathtub looks pretty nice. It's got a shelf, one of those built-in wall shelves. So, not bad. I'd say it's not bad. So let's go out and look at the bedroom part. So then next to the bathroom, still in this little entryway, there's a dresser with a lamp. And there's also a really big full length mirror, which I like a lot. And then here is the room. So we had asked for a room with a king bed, but um, they're having a ton of check-in issues. And this is all that they could give us was a room with two queens. So we're gonna take it, it's better than having no room. So those look decent. And then there's a light, it looks like above each bed. I like that. An end table in the middle. Pretty standard stuff there. And I like this whole setup of the mini bar and TV and desk. I think that's a nice looking arrangement and like a cool big weird piece of wall furniture. I like that. So this snack and mini bar setup is one where you can't, like don't even touch anything. Like you can't lift anything or move it or else they charge you for it. And I'm like afraid to even open the fridge. Do you think I can open it? Will they charge me? JK. I can't actually open it. Awesome. Well, that'll help not buy anything from the mini bar accidentally because you can't open it. Okay. Um, then there's an ice bucket and glasses and little magazines, menus. I hate to see what the room service costs. Let's, let's look and see if you want food delivered to your room. Let's see. What are we saying? Salad, 19 bucks. I mean, everything else seems pretty. No, not really, JK. $20 for an omelet? Ooh wee. That's expensive getting room service. So I will I will pass on the room service for Yeah, I'll just we'll just go have a meal at the restaurant. Um, nice big TV, desk area with two chairs, and uh, trash cans, some more drawers. And then our view really isn't anything to write home about, but I think it's cool. If nothing else, I mean, it's different and we're on vacation, so it's a little more exciting than anything I see at home. We can see Treasure Island, and behind that is the wing. And then here's the, okay, so I'm not sure which wing, but we're in one of the wings of the Mirage. And there's the Beatles picture, because they have a, some kind of Beatles Cirque show here. And we have really big windows too. So I, I do like that. 
And then you can just see the highways and the mountains, which is something we never ever see, of course, being from Illinois. So the mountains are really cool. And um, I'm hoping we can go on that um, that wheel, that high roller wheel later, to get a better view of the land and the mountains. So this is what we think is the conservatory at the Bellagio, where they have all the like flower arrangements. <laughs> Okay, so now I am going to unpack. Um, I am just a mess. We're exhausted. We were up at four o'clock this morning because we needed so much time to, well, you know, just get things ready, you know, in the morning, like get ready to go. And then by the time we got to the airport, parked the car, took the shuttle to the airport and made sure we arrived before our flight two hours early in case security is bad, you know? Yeah, I, I woke up at four and luckily I did sleep on the plane quite a bit, but I'm still just pooped because we've already walked more than 10,000 steps today and according to my Fitbit. So I'm exhausted and it's what time? Three o'clock in the afternoon. So we're going to rest. I'm going to unpack some things and then I'll, I don't know what we're going to do tonight. I have no idea. Okay, we're on our way to dinner, but there's the mirage from the outside, at least in the evening. It's nice to take the video now instead of earlier today because it was so sunny. So we're heading to the Venetian, hopefully to have dinner. Um, we're gonna go find our restaurant. Oh, gondola rides. He's singing too.
this is the cornbread skillet. Is that what it's yes. called? Yeah. yeah, so it's the cornbread, and we're gonna try it and take it with it. Okay, so the cornbread is amazing. It's really, really good. Sorry, it is so loud in here, but here's our order short roots. Did I say the funny again? Short ribs. I keep saying it. Sounded fine to me. Okay. And here's the fried okra. And over there is the burger and fries. And the mac and cheese. And here are the beignets that I'm getting for dessert. And they're filled with Nutella. And now we're heading back. Because um, this is because we were out this way earlier. We're heading back to the high roller wheel. Off the high roller and um, I was absolutely terrified I'd been on it a few years ago and it wasn't so bad but now I just can't handle it and yeah very very scary very high you can feel certain movements I thought I stopped moving at some point uh, yeah oh maybe I'm covering the microphone anyway not my thing everybody else had a nice time everybody else that was in our pod our cabin I did not. I did not like it. Here's the lobby of the Mirage. I like it a lot. I like all the plants and the flowers and the waterfalls. And the big dome too. are like fuzzy. Ooh. This is pantry. This is where we're having breakfast. Here's the menu. This is more of the lunchy type stuff and I guess dinner maybe. And then this side has the breakfast menu. And I'm getting breakfast. In this little basket, they have tiny jars of jellies. That's very cute. And here's a strawberry thing. Yeah. Okay, so here's our drinks, and they're really super cute because they come in these little jars. I like that. That's cute. We got blueberry pancakes, and they come with these little things of syrup that are very, very cute. And you got, can I show that? An omelet and smash browns and toast. Okay, so now we are walking to, I don't know where we're walking to, we're just walking. Yeah, so we finished our breakfast and the blueberry pancakes were very good. I thought I thought they were great. And I'm not normally a fruit, like a blueberry or apple pancake type of person, but I really liked them. And you got an omelet, mm -hmm. did you like it? It was okay, yeah. Okay. I was just trying to find something lighter, so I wasn't going for something real delicious. Yeah, we wanted, we wanted something a little bit lighter. But it was still good. Good. And you had a side of hash browns, but they're called smash browns. Yeah. And I tried some with you, and they were very good. Yeah, it's like it was different. rest of potatoes. Yeah, little potatoes that were like actually smashed. Seasoned and were good. Yes. Okay. And the orange juice was good too, so I think we all enjoyed our meal. And now we're going to walk in whatever degree heat this is. 
and hope to not get all sunburned or crispy or overheated. Yeah, I'm glad it's a little bit overcast right now. I can see it. 20% chance of rain all day. Okay. Right across from the Mirage is, well, this, whatever this kind of strip of shopping is, but then the Harrah's oh, no, no. Hotel. That's an interesting big screen up there. What'd you do in the back of your leg? Oh, uh, probably just cut it shaving. Are you sure? I don't know. I assume that's what it is. Have you seen it? No. <laughs> <laughs> mm. Ugh. I mean, that's red. Yeah. Here's the entrance to the forum shops. It's Caesar's Palace. I'm hoping we come back here later in our trip to do some shopping. Oh boy. Punching a horse in the face? Huh? No, he's not punching a horse in the face. Gosh, Caesar's Palace is just enormous. There's the Margaritaville. We ate there in Orlando. Yeah. We're back by the Link Hotel because we're gonna go try and find like a monorail tram thingy. And we think it's by the high roller wheel. This place is coming, well, it's supposed to come this summer. I love sugar. I wish it was open now. We can go right, erase whatever this is, a Ferrari. Oh, the misters. Don't miss the camera, wait. Oh. Yeah, the mist feels nice. Oh yeah. No, it can sit or you can go down. Lay down. Whoa. Wow. I'll pass. Yes, that's a problem. So Sprinkles was here and I was really looking forward to getting a cupcake yesterday and it's gone now. They're replacing it with this goofy thing. I'd rather have the sprinkles. Here's one of our favorite places. It's the Honolulu Cookie Company. And yesterday I tried this new fall flavor. Oh, do I think I tried them both? I don't know. I definitely tried the pumpkin. They also have cinnamon apple. And this place is the best because they give you free samples of cookie pieces. Yes. But they're like shortbread cookies. I don't know that I don't know how to describe it. It's like shortbread cookies and some of them are dipped in chocolate and stuff. And they're so good. There's a monorail pulling in down there. Okay, so we had to come up here a couple flights to get tickets and stuff I guess and then we'll go back down to actually board. So we're at Hera's slash the link station and I think we want to get off at MGM. Okay, we got our tickets and we're going to board the southbound train whenever it gets here. Southbound platform. Next stop is the Caesar's Palace Station.